everybody was ready to go swimming. The pool at an Escondido apartment complex for seniors was closed for repairs for nearly a year when residents called us for help. It's fixed now, but residents, they're still waiting to dive in. This is an update to a story we first brought to you last month. We are working for you to find out why the seniors can't swim or even cool off in the pool just yet. CBS 8's Abby Black joins us live from Escondido with the answers. Abby. Marcella and Carlo, last month our questions led to the seniors living here at the Birchmont apartment complex in Escondido to get their pool repaired. It's been finished, but they still can't get inside to take a swim. We're working for you to find out and get clarification on what's going on. Locked out. Dana Matson wants to know why he can't take a dip in the sparkling pool where he lives at Birchmont Senior Apartment Complex in Escondido. I didn't get any straight answers as far as I'm concerned. This is the second time Matson reached out to CBS 8 for help. It had been 10 months and we got nowhere and uh, I decided to call Channel 8 News and you guys were on it immediately. Working for you, CBS 8 called and emailed property managers last month to find out why work on a swimming pool was abandoned for 10 months. The day after our inquiries, crews arrived to repair the existing pool. One of the uh, construction guys, he told me that it wasn't about permits, he says it was about money. Management told CBS 8 the delay was because of permits, but the city manager told us they couldn't find any permit applications. Three weeks later, we're back to find out why there's water in the pool, but it's still closed. Residents have told me that it's now been prepared, but now they're being told that they can't go in for another month. I called the apartment office. The person declined an on-camera interview, but did tell me on the phone they're waiting for the pool to cure in the county's final inspection. I, I'm just trying to clear up any confusion. I spoke to a pool expert and confirmed what he told me. He says the National Plasters Council recommends a 28-day waiting period for a pool to cure and balance chemicals. Okay, I'm going to check with the county on that then. The county tells me under the Department of Environmental Health and Quality, or DHQ, there are state regulations pertaining to construction, maintenance, and water quality of swimming pools. They say when the pool is complete and before opening for swimmers, the operators will call DHQ and schedule a final inspection to ensure it's safe. A spokesperson says plans for the Birchmont improvements were submitted on April 29, 2024 and approved on July 1st. This is long after residents say the pool work was abandoned. Uh, it sucks. It's just showing no respect for the tenants. If all goes well, the pool could be inspected and approved by mid-August. Summer's over in another month. So we've, we've, we will have waited over a year. Matson says that during this pool closure, of course, he could not use the pool, but the apartment still jacked up his rent $200. Marcella. Abby, you know, if you have a swimming pool at home, I'm just curious, and you want to replaster or surface that, do you also have to submit plans to the county and let them have a final inspection? Well, that's what Right. I mean, I learned that through the process because I thought, well, what about people who have their own private pools at home? Do they have to get approval from the county? Because this wasn't really something that I had heard of before. And no, if you have your own private pool that's own at home, if you're doing some normal replaster resurfacing, you do not need the county's approval. That's what they say. Now, the Birchmont pool here in Escondido, it is considered a public pool, so it would need the county's approval. All right. Well, hopefully it will open in the next couple of weeks. Thanks for getting to the bottom of that. Remember, if there's something you'd like us to look into, email us at workingforyou at cbs8.com.